Hello my brothers and sisters, and welcome back to another action episode of Chris the Butcher and Friends. And tonight, morning, evening, noon, whatever you're watching this, it doesn't really matter, does it? it's, evening, it's afternoon right now. We're here because of Spice and Easy. Yes, Spice and Easy got a little channel, I'll put a link to their channel in the description. Also, I'll put a link to their website in the description where you can buy these fabulous curry mixes from. Right, and sent me this one now. Sent me this. Spice and Easy Fire Powder. Right, I don't know how hot this is going to be. Uh, but it does, uh, if possible, wear protective gloves. Shit. <laughs> I'm not going to be doing right. You know, I'm going to get this in every single nick and cranny in the skin. You know, if I've got a little nick I don't know about, I'm going to fucking find out. But yeah. Uh, it's a quarter or whatever. Normally they do these way they do the curry mixes where you mix it with tomato paste and water and stuff. Very good. Very cheap as well, right? Uh, but I did say I'm gonna make a burger with this, and that's what we're gonna to do today. We're making a spicy and easy fire powder burger. Also, I'm gonna do it justice, I'm gonna get outside and cook it on barbecue. <laughs> First thing we're going to do, good old fashioned, good quality mince in a pan. Now I put it in a pan because I can't find my bowl to mix it. So we've got our, as you can see there, our firepower. Our uh, powder, sorry. <laughs> I'm just going to take the lot in, right? I don't know how hot this is going to be, but it's all in. And I just want to incorporate that powder in all that fucking hell. Fire. I tell you what, this smells pretty, pretty potent, I'll be honest. You right. can see it. it. Smells fucking good though. It smells really good. It smells tasty. It smells, it's, I have, I'm hoping this is going to be more tasty than the heat. Although I can take the heat, I do like, uh, I do like a bit of taste every now and then, you know what I mean? And uh, that powder is going right up my nose. Uh, any minute now, I'll probably sneeze. <laughs> right, the trick with a burger is not to over pound, over grind the mince, because you don't want it to go tough. It'll end up like a meatloaf consistency otherwise. So, that smells good. That's how a mix done. Bang! I'll be back in a minute. Right, this is going to make a few burgers, right? Uh, and I, there's probably me, only me going to be eating them, I'll be honest, right? So, let's, uh, how big are we going to do these burgers? Not too big, because I'm planning on putting, I'm using a bagel, right, for the bun. I'm planning on putting uh, three burgers on this bagel. Alright? Uh, that's shit. It's still up my nose, right? No word of a lie, it is still up my nose and I want to sneeze. Uh, my nose is now running, and all I've done is mix it in some mince. Right, so it now sounds like I've got a bit of a cold, but uh, we'll have to persevere with that. <laughs> Al, you bastard. What are you doing to me? That, is going, that has really, really got me up my nostrils. And uh, yeah, we're just going to make some burgers with a shine a light. Uh, something, I don't want them too thick, I don't want them too thin, because it, it will tend to expand on the, uh, on the, on the heat. Fuck me, Al, you're fucking killing me with that. I didn't go and blow my pissy nose. Right, there is one burger done, I've got five more to do, so I'll, uh, I will crack up with that, and, uh, I'm going to fridge these for 20 minutes. And then we're going to uh, 
bang them up charcoal there's our burgers there's our coals right let's get them on oh sizzle sizzle right no exact science don't know how long i'm cooking these for but we'll find out right we're going for our first turn oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Shit. not burning myself or not oil i'm burning myself or not coals now them look and smell mighty fine Right, then went for about five minutes. So I'm gonna let them go for another five minutes. I'm gonna add some cheese, then I'm gonna stack them, and I'm gonna spray my bagel there, bagel, with fry light, and then we're gonna build the bastard. Right, if you ask me, them burgers are nigh on perfect. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna let them go for another minute with the cheese on. Also, because I've not used the binder in the burger, the cheese will help bind it together as well. So we'll have to let that go for another, about two minutes, I think. Them are nearly done. Uh, let's do it this way. One, two, three. So, we've got our tower of burgers. We're not finished there, have we? Because I've got a bagel, garlic fry like, you see it? Oh. On. On. We'll let that toast for about a minute. Yes, a minute! That is done for me. We'll get our bagel. We're going to get our burger on our bagel and we'll get our top on. Now, I know it's not doing it justice there, but that is one top-notch fucking burger. So there it is, my spice and easy fire powder burger. Now, if, if I was a bit quiet outside, every fucker's outside, right? All the neighbours, and I'm very shy, I don't like... That's why I don't vlog, right? Because I don't like talking in front of people. But here we go. I thought I'd cut it in half for our viewing pleasure. And that is oh, magical. Look at that bastard there right there now. That is amazing. And we've got Kieran running out through the kitchen. He's about to jump in the hot tub. <laughs> it's three year old he's going to get in hot tub with a brandy and a cigar <laughs> there's my spice and easy fire powder burger Curtis of spice and easy I told you the link will be in the description to their website and their YouTube channel now I've got to slide this down my gizzard now when I was mixed it with the meat it made my nose run like Linford Christie. Uh, so I don't know how hot this is going to be, but hey, just, let's just slide it down my gizzard and find out. Eh? I'm dripping shit everywhere. You know what? That is quite hot. <laughs> but fucking taste is unreal. Mmm. I think that's fine. <laughs> that, my brothers and sisters, has got a really, really good kick to it. It's burning in the back of my throat. But it's one of those burns that makes me want to burn it more and eat more.
Now, Al, if you can produce that fire powder in two and a half kilo tubs, uh, I'm sure my work would buy two or three off you. And we make chilli burgers out of that, because that is fucking out of this world. Oh, right. Oh, I bet it weird. Mm. <laughs> mm. Fuck me, where's my beer? My mouth's on fucking fire. <laughs> oh, I don't know what I'll tell you what, that is packing some serious heat. And I don't think my beer's going to cut it. I'm probably going to need some milk for that. But you know what? Thank you to Spice and Easy for sending that. The taste was really, really good. The heat's fucking powerful. It's not a Carolina Reaper, but fuck me, it's up there. My face is on fire, my mouth, my tongue, my throat. I've had it cups, but the taste makes up for that. And I was, that was what I worried about, it was going to be too hot. It had no taste. Not all worries about that, it was tasty as fuck, right? So, if you want to buy any of these seasons off Spice and Easy, I'll put a link in the description to their website. Uh, I also put a link to their YouTube channel. They do very good live streams. They do fucking videos and this, that, and the other. I'm using all these spice packs, so check them out. And they use them in different ways, like I've just used that in a fucking burger. And my face is on fire. Right? So, I like that. If you like it, press like, comment, share it on your social media, and subscribe. And become a family member of hashtag Team CTB. Right? Fucking love you. You know what? I can't put this fucking down. Mm -mm -mm.